Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a haul for you. I partnered up with Hush to bring you guys this haul. So let me show you the box that they sent over. So this is the, bo the box that they sent. I'm really excited to see what's in there. Hush carries a variety of different products. They have brushes, they have makeup, they carry different lines. They have um, Sigma, they have Profusion, Koki, Elf. They carry brushes, they carry Korean skincare. They also have masks. I mean, they just have a variety of products on their website. So I'm gonna leave their website name right here so you guys can check them out if you'd like. They offer free shipping on orders $25 and over. I've heard great things about Hush. I know they have a lot of different palettes that are dupes for more high-end palettes that are out of my price range. So if you wanna see what I got, let's get started. So let's get started with this unboxing. I'm just gonna take my scissors to open this box and hopefully I don't hurt myself. I'm opening the box. Let's see what's in there. All right, so as soon as I open the box, this is what I see, bubble wrap. So that's really nice, so that way your palettes stay protected. Um, let's keep going. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I am so impressed by the way they package this stuff because sometimes I feel like different retailers will package their stuff with that big air bag and then like your palettes come broken. So I mean, the fact that they take the time to wrap their stuff up really well is pretty impressive. All right, so so far there are three palettes in here and like two or three in here. So let me open these with my scissors. I don't know, I'll speed through this or something and then I'll be right back. Oh my gosh, my kids are gonna love this stuff so I'm gonna save that for them. Okay, aside from them being in this big old bubble wrap, they also have individual bubble wrap. So that's pretty awesome. All right, so these are all the palettes. I'm gonna take them out of their individual sleeve and I will be right back. All right, so the first one up is this Inferno palette. Now the packaging on this is pretty nice, if you ask me. I'm thinking this is like warm tones or something like that because of the packaging, but I don't even know what the palette looks like inside. So let's open it and find out. So the quality of this palette is pretty impressive considering that this is an affordable palette on their website. Um, I'm gonna leave pricing and things like that on here just for reference. So let's open this palette. Oh my gosh, you guys. This is so pretty. I'm gonna show you guys the palette, Warm Tones. It's so beautiful. I can't wait to swatch these. I mean, I can't even wait to play with these. I already have my makeup done today, so I'm not gonna film a makeup tutorial, but let me know if you want to see a makeup tutorial using any one of these palettes. I'd be more than happy to do that for you in a future video. The next one is this Bad Habit Retro Love. Now, I'm not sure what is in here, so let's find out together. The packaging for these is really, really impressive, guys. The packaging reminds me of like Lorac. Oh my gosh, this is so pretty. Once again, it has that protective sleeve and this reminds me of an Anastasia palette of some kind. So this is what it looks like. This palette looks really cool, so I'm excited to play with this as well. So the next palette I have for you guys is the Bad Habit Aura palette. I wanna say that's how you say it. If I'm mispronouncing it, I am so sorry. So this is what the packaging looks like. So it looks just like it's the box. Oh my goodness, look at that. Look at those colors, they're beautiful. So let's see how some of these swatch. Now I'm not a professional swatcher here, so my swatches may not be the best. I'm taking the color Destiny, which is this blue one. So let's see what that swatch is like. You know what, this one swatch is really pretty. It's almost like it does have that dark base, but let's, let's give it a second coat. Wow, that definitely builds up nicely. Let me wipe my finger off. I'm gonna try this Ecstasy color. So that's this one. Let's swatch that one. Okay. Like I said, guys, I am no professional swatcher. So, whoa, look at the, oh my gosh. I'm looking at them with you in the viewfinder and I'm like, those are so nice. Okay, so from the swatches, I do have a little bit of fallout on my hand, but still, I mean, that's beautiful. So the next one I'll be swatching is Radiate, and that's this one. Okay, so that's one, so let me put a second one on there. 
Um, I'm really excited to see what these colors look like on my eyes. Okay, let's swatch this color right here. It's called Manifest. And then I also want to swatch this one, which is Vibe. But look at that. Whoa, those colors are so amazing. The next palette is by the brand Bad Habit, and it's called Royals. So this one too is so beautiful. It, this one is different though. It has a sleeve, not a box. So the packaging, once again, is very impressive, very nice, especially, like I said, for affordable makeup. I can't say that enough. This is what the packaging looks like on Royals, and it's just beautiful. This is the back, and this one reminds me of the Modern Renaissance palette. So I had to go get my son, so now I'm back. But as I was saying, I left off with the Athena and the Aphrodite palette. Sorry if I'm butchering that. I'm really bad with pronunciations sometimes. Especially now that I have my braces on, I get tongue twisted so much more easily. And yeah, I'm so excited about these. I can't wait. So which one should we start off with? This one or this one? So the first one I'm gonna open is the Bad Habit Athena palette. Now, I, I've i heard that these are Huda Beauty eyeshadow palette dupes. So I don't own any of the Huda Beauty palettes. I just never picked them up or anything like that, but I always thought they were beautiful colors. So it's really nice to see that, you know, Bad Habit came out with their own version of it and it's more affordable. So that's pretty cool. Um, wow, these are beautiful colors. Wow, this darling color. It, oh, and look at this, guys. It comes with a mirror. So I forgot to say, but the packaging is also beautiful on this. It is cruelty-free, and it comes in a box. So look at this. It's a magnetic shut palette, so that's really nice. It's lightweight, so you can tr easily travel with this. Another thing is it comes with a mirror. Wow, that's amazing. And the mirror is really nice has like some plastic on there to peel off. Oh my gosh, guys, the mirror in this is amazing. I love it. It's beautiful. Wow. It does have the plastic protective on there. So I'm just gonna go ahead and remove that. Look at these colors. Beautiful. Wow. This one right here looks like pure glitter. So moving on to the Bad Habit Aphrodite palette. This is an 18 color eyeshadow palette. And let's see, oh, it comes in a box, it's not a sleeve, and once again, it's the same, it's the same exact packaging as this, but just black, and it's so beautiful. This is also cruelty free, and look at this, oh my gosh, you guys, it also comes with a mirror. This is amazing, I mean, these mirrors are really great quality, I'm like so obsessed with the mirrors, oh my gosh, but the palette, whoa. These colors are so beautiful. Look at this. Look at those colors. They're so pretty. I, I want to say I like both of these the same, but look at these. The magnets makes it so hard for it to get lined up easily. But look at these. Oh, so pretty. So I want to say I'm almost more excited for the Athena palette. They're both beautiful, don't get me wrong. But I want to say I want to try the Athena palette next. So I'm going to go ahead and insert some swatches for these palettes. All right, so next I'm going to be swatching this Inferno palette and I'm going to swatch this top row. Now moving on to this bottom row and we're going to start with this color. Oh my gosh, this is so pretty. Let's start with this one. Okay, let's try this pop. Well, this one is very cool tone. So next, I want to try this Rebel color right here. Okay, so that's Rebel. I'm going to swatch this Mood color. Let's swatch a few from the bottom. So let's try this Revolution. Wow, this one's so pretty. Let's swatch this one. Free Love. The color's really pretty. Okay, so this one got a little bit powdery. So I'm gonna start on this bottom row and work my way that way. I have a little assistant here. My son, Ryan, is in the house. Say hi, Ryan. Hi. <laughs> I also wanna say thank you to my son, Ryan, for helping me swatch. It was a lot easier once I had his little arm to swatch on. 
it's easier putting swatches on someone else's arm than it is putting swatches on your own arm. <laughs> I've never done swatches on my channel before. It's not as easy as it looks. And All right guys, that pretty much completes this haul. I want to say that I was really blown away by the quality of not only the packaging, but the eyeshadows look amazing. Now, I just want to say that I haven't tried any of these eyeshadows on my eyes, so I don't know how they perform on the eyes. So if you guys are interested in a makeup tutorial including any of these palettes, please leave your request or suggestions in the comments down below. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.